Hi, this is Kat with Beataholic, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a cone to a tassel that you've made with the Beatalon Tassel Maker tool. If you haven't already, please watch our how to use the Tassel Maker tool because it'll tell you how to assemble and how to make the tassel to get to this point. But to complete it, what you're going to need is you're going to need a bead cone, some of the cord, which I used to make the tassel. This is our cotton tassel cord. I have a 20 gauge artistic wire here, about eight to 10 inches or so. And I've noticed that you can use a 20 gauge or you can use a 22 gauge and that works just fine. So for tools, you're going to need a wire looping plier, a wire straightening tool, a pair of scissors, a chain nose plier, and a pair of flush cutters. So those are all the tools you need. So let's get started. So I've come to this point where I've made my knots here at the bottom and I've wound it around and you can just see that and I have my knot nice and secure. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to just take off this top part and release that cord from the tension there. There we go. And now I'm just going to go ahead and slide this off because I'm going to make one long tassel and I can set my tool aside. And now you see that I have my tassel here. And now all I'm going to do is I'm going to take my scissors and I'm just going to cut at the midpoint there. And you can bring both sides down and snip them off and make them all nice and even now. So now that I have my tassel, I'm just going to take my piece of wire here and push it up through and make a nice tight loop around the top. And holding this piece right here, I'm just going to bend my loop around making it nice and tight and making just a nice little wire loop at the top. And there we go. Pinch that in nice and tight. And don't worry about making this side too pretty because you won't see it. But then go ahead and snip off that excess wire there. And now you can just tuck that in just a little bit more if you like. So now this is the portion that's going to fit up through my cone here. There we go. And now if you want, you can use your wire straightening tools and just kind of straighten that out for yourself. Take your wire looping pliers and go ahead and get right up tight there and pinch it around. And then you'll just continue your wrap and wrap once and twice. There we go. Right around one more time. And I'm just going to snip that off with my flush cutters. And just tuck this back in. And straighten out my loop there a little bit. And there you go. There is how to add a bead cone to a tassel. And if you want, actually, mine got a little uneven, so I'm just gonna even that up real quick. Make it nice and pretty. A little haircut. <laughs> there we go. There we go. I'm much happier with that. All right. Oh, that looks so fun. I like it. Very cute. Okay, so there you go. So that's how to add the cone to the tassel once you've made it. And I think this is a great little tool and you're gonna love using it. Um, this is the Beatalon Tassel Maker tool. We have a full video showing you how to do that. But then if you wanna continue, you can watch this video again to see how to add a cone to the tassel.